Hi everyone, I'm Deb with Clothed in Abundance. I'm so excited for today's video. It's my Poshmark Resellers Thrift Haul, and I'm gonna show you guys everything that I picked up from the Value Village 50% off everything sale. I bought a bunch of stuff, and I'm super excited to show you. So, let's jump into it. These are just shoes, and this, oh my gosh, is so heavy. The first thing that I picked up are these Urban Outfitters Creepers. They are this like nude taupe. I researched them at Value Village and I saw people sold them and these are pretty much like brand new, like never been worn. So yeah, even the insides are like perfect. The next thing that I picked up are these Sam Edelman Zebra uh, animal print heels and they have this beautiful mix of like zebra and like cheetah print. Um, they're super cute and they have like a really cute chunky heel. And I'm so excited for these. Um, they're a size 10, 10 and a half. So I'm really looking forward to selling these guys. If they don't sell, I'm gonna keep them. Next up are these Nikes that I got and I'm gonna have to do some work with them a little bit. The soles are a little bit worn, but I'm gonna try to whiten the soles of the shoes and yeah, these should be pretty good to sell. Um, Nikes do fairly well for me. Hopefully they will sell soon. I paid eight bucks for them, so 50% off. For, so $4 for Nike sneakers. Granted, they are a size 11, um, but I really think that these will sell. Almost done with shoes. I got these Adidas. Um, they have a special name, so I'll make sure to put it in the video. But these were originally $16, and they're like a size 9, 9.5. They're in fairly good condition, and they have the really cute holographic um, back to them. And then they have like the all white here. These I feel like are gonna sell because they're a popular size. Um, oh, they are. These are the Adidas Neo Foam Memory Footbed. The last pairs of shoes I got were a huge splurge. They were originally $40, but I picked them up for $20, and they are an authentic Tory Burch um, loafer, and they look like this, and um, I saw these shoes in the exact size that I got sell on Poshmark so I figured I had to get these and I will make sure that I um, clean up the bottoms but they're in really good addition again they're in a size 11 11 and a half and I think even someone with wide feet could probably fit in them if they're like a 10 and a half um, but they are the authentic ones and they have like the little TT emblem on them and they're this beautiful like navy blue and white stripe loafer. They're super cute, barely worn, so I'm really hoping to get about like 60 bucks out of these. Okay, next up are the clothes that I got, and um, I found this BCBG Generation hooded uh, coat, and it is like such good quality, you guys. It has a really nice like fur interior, and it's that really trendy olive green color also with the leather patch on it and lots of zipper detailings with the logo on it and um, this was originally like $15 it's in a size large next up is this Target um, shirt that I got this is in a 3x I believe no 2x yeah 2xl and it's super cute it has like this lace at the bottom if y'all can see that um, and I figured that this would sell right now um, this was I paid a dollar fifty for the shirt next up for jackets I got this BP and I remembered that that was from Nordstrom's I paid about five bucks for this jacket originally $9.99 and it's in a size medium how cute is this denim jacket sells super fast for me wait for this jacket $5.50 um, and it looks like this it's a little bit darker than the other denim jacket 
but I figure someone could either wear it oversized or um, rocket a fitted jacket if that's their size. And yeah, it's super, super cute. Really good, high quality denim. So I'm hoping to list that at least $25. Okay, the last jacket that I picked up I was a little bit nervous about because it's not really my style, but I figured other people might love it. And it's this Sigrid Olsen pink bomber. It's in a size 10 and I paid about $6.50 for this jacket. And it's super, super cute. It has like no markings on it at all. It's this really gorgeous bomber jacket. The jacket like buttons up really nicely. The last items that I got were all shirts, I believe. Maybe a couple dresses, but most of them were shirts. I got this Calvin Klein shirt, and this is in fun print. Um, this will be cute for work for someone. And I found this J. Crew um, peplum top, and I got it in a. It's in a size extra large. Y'all, look how cute this is. It has this kind of like spandexy like material at the top. And then the bottom is this really cute velvet material. Oh, this is like such good quality and it's a v-neck and it's gonna look so good on whoever wears this. Then I picked up this and I think it's a new day. They sell this at Target um, and it's this really fun like polka dot. It's not even a polka dot, but it's just this fun printed dress and it's in a size uh, large and it's a super cute shift dress um, yeah it actually would go a little bit below the knee and I'm really excited to sell this piece as well okay last jacket I actually found was this Adidas jacket I paid up for this one this was originally like 19 bucks I remember yeah 18.50 and so I got it for 50% off but I thought it would be a really good sell um, it's in a size two extra large and it's just a really nice lightweight like tracksuit so I think this will sell um, even if it's like if it is unisex or something like that um, but yeah it's just this really cool navy blue color and I really like this a lot um, so hopefully Whoever buys it enjoys it as well. It has kind of that like high collar up here. And then, dude, the inside, look how bomb the inside is. It's like netted. And it has some netting like by the armpit. So you just air out. Like, such a cool piece. Then I got this Nine West top, which I was immediately drawn to the color. Obviously, I have a thing for metallics. I'm wearing some now, so I figured why not add it to my Poshmark closet and on Mercari. Um, so yeah, I got this Nine West shirt, and it has like the tie in the front. It's in a size large. It definitely looks like it could fit a size medium, and it's a V-neck. But yeah, I think this will be really cute for fall and just for like workwear or going out or something like that. So. Oh my gosh and I found this Banana Republic white peplum top it's so many cute peplum pieces and you might not be able to see it just because it looks a little bit wrinkly but it definitely has like a floral print like embossed on it and this was originally $9.50 so and this is in a size 14 okay then I found this Skies are blue, which I didn't know the brand at first, but they're a popular plus size brand. Um, and they, this shirt was in a size large, and it's this really pretty, like sheer um, black shirt with a cute ruffle down the front. It has like a scoop neck, almost V neck style, and then it has like a little keyhole in the front. Super, super cute. It comes down um, really nicely. So I figured someone would like that for work. I got a lot of workwear inspired stuff. So found this Calvin Klein leopard printed top. It has more yellow in it than I think the camera is showing. And it was originally six bucks, so I got it for three dollars. 
will definitely be selling this for way more than three dollars um yeah it's actually like super cute so and it has like a gold button detail on the back y'all can see that it's like a really cute gold button um it's super nice and it's like a higher neck. Then I also got this J. Crew sequined olive green shirt. Someone is so gonna love this for fall. It's actually really, really beautiful and really well made. It doesn't seem like cheap sequins at all. I paid six bucks for it and it's in a size large and it can definitely fit a size extra large. Um, yeah, this is such a cute shirt and it's like soft too. So got that one. Next items that I picked up are from Ann Taylor and they are three shirts but different colors, the same cut and style. And so it's this shirt right here. It's cream at the top and then the bottom is color blocked to black. I think this is actually super cute. It also has a zipper detailing at the bottom. Um, I did not check to see how much this originally cost, but I'm thinking like 25. Um, and then hopefully they'll bundle it, but 25 each for these shirts at least. And one in this bright red color, which is so pretty. Oh my gosh. Excited. And it zippers down both sides. So they are all in a size large. I feel like there's another one, um, but I just decided to get all three. Together, they were $17. Okay. Then I got this top from J. Crew. And it looks like this. It has a zipper down the back. It looks like it's never been worn before. Um, yeah, so it's this really gorgeous lavender color. It's in a size large. Definitely could fit a size medium. It's a bit small, um, but it's so cute and it has like layers at the bottom and I think someone will like this for back to school or something like that. Um, and it's like also like layered on the sleeve. So it has some chiffon here and then it has like a cotton tank. It's just so gorgeous. I really like this shirt. Bought this leather jacket. Oh my gosh, you guys. It's super, super, super cute. It's this cognac brown color. If this was my size, I would so keep this. Um, I paid $10 for it. It's originally by the brand Cripple Creek. And like, I'm so obsessed with it. It's just like the perfect brown leather jacket. It has no marks on it whatsoever. Like, it's just this gorgeous color. Even the buttons are just like perfectly intact. I swear, if I could fit into this, I'm not gonna try on camera, but if I could, I would be keeping it. Um, but yeah, so I got this jacket. I'm not super familiar with the brand, but this is definitely going for at least um, 55 in my closet just because it's a really good leather so I'm so excited with this jacket so grand total I spent $131.26 I actually got like a little extra discount because the manager and I just like really bonded so that was really cool um, 61 but he gave me a really good discount so I saved like 21 bucks so thank you so much to the manager at Valley Village. You're so awesome. And um, yeah, this is my Poshmark thrift haul. So I need to go and list a lot of these items. Um, maybe I'll list some of my shoes tonight just so they're up on my Poshmark closet. And then, um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this thrift haul video. If you haven't checked out your local value village, you definitely should. They have really good sales. Let me know if you guys are also a Poshmark or Mercari or eBay reseller. Leave your closets down below. I wanna follow and support you guys. Um, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and thumbs up this video. And I will see you guys in my next thrift store haul. Bye.